Hello guys, in this video tutorial, I am going to show you how to enter data in EPData InterClient. First of all, open EPData InterClient. Then go over open project and click uh, open project. Okay. And then go over here. I have saved my file in desktop. So I'm going over desktop and the file is epdata.epx epx dot epx, epx format so uh, i'm opening this file okay. this is the form where you can enter data here i'm randomly entering data participant id ethnicity Do you smoke? Um, yeah, this uh, the question I have skipped. If I enter yes, then it uh, it goes to the next question. If yes question. If I enter here no, then it go. If I enter here no, then it goes to the next question. Um, here right now I am entering yes. I smoke forty five sticks a day. Okay, <laughs> and then diabetes yes, yes. Blood glucose one twenty two point five. I'm um, hyperthyroidism <laughs> with uh, 56 142 centimeter okay west need set okay and again I'm entering another data parts of ID No, the diabetes, yes, hypertension. Yeah. If uh, we enter the value beyond the given range, then it will say it's either there. Uh, that, that helps us to minimize the either uh, wrong entry, either due to wrong entry. Hypertension. In this way you can enter it and finally you need to save the file save the project okay now your data you have enter uh, you, now you are done with this data we have entered uh, many more data here up to four data here and in this way you can enter data and once you find error or difficulties while entering data then you can go over EP data manager and you can edit it and the data are saved here in this uh, data are also saved and there is there will be no problem so you can edit at any time in EP data manager uh, that is one of the advantages and thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe share and comment on this video thank you